God bless this ceremony because it's not going to be the first between our two countries. Let's have many more signs of very close and very genuine co cooperation between our two countries. I thank you very much. Indeed, we have had fruitful deliberations during the bilateral talks with our respective delegations. And we have also signed three instruments that will further enhance our relations. Among them is the Memorandum of Understanding of Cooperation in the Field of Sports. And this will see our two countries enhance cooperation in training and the application of sports operations. We in Kenya are also keen to learn from our brothers in Lesotho about developing the textile sector. And we recognize that the kingdom has deployed technology utilizing branding and market positioning to develop one of the best textile industries in the African continent. We are on the verge of reviving our textile industry, which has the potential to create high value jobs to help us deal with the challenge of employ unemployment that is facing our youth. Prime Minister, the Kingdom of Lesotho continues to be one of Kenya's strongest allies on the global stage. Indeed, your endorsement of Kenya as the African Union's candidate for the non-permanent seat on the United Nations Security Council for 2021-22 is an affirmation of the strong bilateral relations that exist between our two sister countries. Finally, Prime Minister, I'm glad that today our two countries are starting a new chapter of bilateral cooperation. The conclusion of a framework for bilateral cooperation and political consultations will ensure that we enhance our political, diplomatic, and trade relations through regular and structured engagements, as well as strategic cooperation. So I therefore urge our respective teams who are here with us today to ensure that the negotiations are completed and that the framework is put in place to carry this forward. Once again, Prime Minister, welcome to Nairobi. Please, you and your delegation feel very much at home while here. And at the same time, as we have said, please do not hesitate to take full advantage of the hospitality of our people and the different sites that are there to be visited.